Italy is known around the world for its food and cuisine. From mesmerizing architecture to ancient ruins, Italian beauty is sought after everywhere in the world. When it comes to movies, our minds are almost instructed to think about the States and about Hollywood. Today, we will explore the history of film in Italy and the values hidden in Italian cinematography. Five point six miles to the southwest of Rome, hidden among the quiet suburbs, lies Cinecittà Studios, Europe's dream factory. It is the largest movie studio in continental Europe, covering an area of ninety-nine acres, and it certainly lives up to its name, Cinecittà, which literally translates to "cinema city." Cinecittà's history has a little controversy because it was created by the infamous. Benito Mussolini, the fascist dictator, which in turn used this film industry as a way to expand his ideals as propaganda. However, despite of Cinecittà's origins, it has had a tremendous influence in Italy's social, cultural, and economical aspects. Cinecittà is a place that could be considered as the Italian Hollywood. In fact, the period in which it was most prominent were the 1950s and 60s. And at this time, Rome was nicknamed the Hollywood on the Tiber because of its relationship with the film industry. Over 3,000 movies have been filmed in Cinecittà, and 47 of them have been Academy Award winners, aka the Oscars. Some famous films include Martin Scorsese's Gangs of New York and Mel Gibson's The Passion of Christ. $800 million dollar Cinecittà World theme park was announced in November 2009 to be in development in hopes to capitalize on past glories. However, the future still remains uncertain for Cinecittà. If it can reinvent itself, then maybe it can find its way back to its golden days of the 1950s and 60s. But whatever the future holds, Cinecittà will always have the splendors of its past.